What is up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Erin Bees. I am a wife, a mom, a military veteran, and I spent 13 and a half years in multi-level marketing, healed my way out of it, and now I am using all my social media platforms to raise awareness and to educate on the dangers of multi-level marketing companies and the tactics that are used by many of the reps involved with these companies. If you're brand new to my channel, what is up? So glad you're here. If you are a subscriber, if you are somebody that is a member, shout out to you guys. I appreciate you. And if you are just somebody that likes to quietly watch, thank you so much. I appreciate every single view and comment. And I can't believe it's been almost a year. What? We'll talk about that in another video. But anyways, today we are going to watch something a little bit different. This actually was sent to me and I watched the first couple minutes of it and there there's a lot of chaos and trying to get it together for for this live video or whatnot but essentially it is sister wives that are shilling plexus yeah so <laughs> this was posted publicly so we are going to react and uh we you and I because you're going to drop your commentary I'm going to give my commentary and then, yeah, you guys know how this goes. So if you'd like to follow me on social media, here are my handles, TikTok, Instagram. I'm also starting to do a little on Twitter too. If you want to follow me over there, it's at Aaron Bees. And uh, yeah, let's get into the video for today. Dean, um, joining us pretty soon. So... Hey, 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 can you guys hear me okay? I'm trying a different setup with my headphones. So hopefully you guys can still hear me. Hey, all right, Christine, do you want to request? Hold on, let me see if I can get you. Hold on. Oh, there you go. Hey. Oh, good, good, good. Christine. Hold hey. On. Yeah, you are. Hi. Hey. Yes. Okay? Can you hear me okay? Yep. 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 Okay. So. I don't know if I'm echoing or not. I was going to try and find my Bluetooth, but okay. I have no idea where it is. None. It's crazy. So we wanted to jump on. You guys heard from me yesterday, but we're just going to, we're going to jump on and talk a little bit, answer any questions you guys might have about these amazing products. They're wonderful tell you that we are so excited going into this fall hey christine did you know that savannah got her driver's license <laughs> is and that she good drove herself to, yes yeah but she drove herself to her first senior year activity and i'm like she, oh my goodness like i don't know no i'm not ready for that yet i know i know i'm not ready i don't know if i can handle that i know hello loves good afternoon evening hi payton that's crazy. She's driving already. I remember oh when you God. were begging us to take her driving. I guess she's oh fine God. now. Oh, I, this is the first child. Like I, you know, you. I feel like, I feel like this part could have been an email. I draw with her that one time when we were there for your birthday party or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. I've had to do most of it myself and, and Cody took her a little bit, but like I, I'm not a good. I'm not a good driver. I'm glad she's my yeah. last one. Right? <laughs> teach, yeah. yeah. Yeah, usually so. my elder kids would come into town and take, hello, beautiful people. Nice. Yes, you know what? Um, These products actually do help. So it is like weight loss, but it's because it's inside out healing. You're going to help your blood glucose metabolism. You're going to help your craving. I know she just said this, and there should have been a comma, but the way that she said this, blood glucose metabolism, that's not a thing. Blood glucose metabolism. <laughs> I'm just saying. You're going to help. Um, it's so I, nice to digest food for the first time in my life. Yeah, that's what right it did for, for me. That was a big part, right? Yeah. Food digestion. So. You know, it was crazy. It was yeah. crazy. Now what we're concentrating on is like... Um, Truly's getting back in school. So she's in middle school. Do you know she's starting middle school? Middle oh my school. gosh. See, that's one of those things where I'm like, really? Really? I, middle I school. Saw her a few weeks ago, you were in town. I saw her a few weeks ago. I thought, wow, she grew. She's like, up to here now. 
Yeah. Yeah. All my kids passed me at 12. So it's her year to pass me. So she's all the way. Is it good for diabetic? You know what, love? Mama Bear Joe. So it was made actually to help people specifically with diabetes. The products are wonderful. They're safe. And if you're, we're not healthcare professionals. So if you have any questions, take the packages to your doctor. Okay. But what you just did is a health claim. You can't say that this MLM product was designed for people with diabetes. You, you can't say that. Oh my God. I can, just, we can send you an ingredient list that you can take to your doctor. For yes. Her. Everything is super available. There's no like hidden anything. Um, I just, there's no hidden anything, nothing, no proprietary blends. We know that that's not the case. There's always hidden things in multi-level marketing companies. Hmm. Barely took an active. Okay, not barely. If I don't take my active before, I'd say three o'clock, I'll be up forever because it's such an effective caffeine. Well, and but it's, it's not, it's like not the mind race. Like it's a no. different kind of caffeine. Like it, and it actually, it does help with basal dilation. So it does. Yeah. There have been people who have seen improvements with their blood pressure. But again, guys, this is what you also can't say that those are health claims. By the way, this video I've already sent to the FTC because I think it's really important. I'm going to save the majority of my commentary around them being celebrities and on a TV show um, until the end, because I do think that this is something that we need to talk about for sure. But I'm going to save that to the end. One of those things we can't tell. I mean, like we're, we're not doctors. And so we would definitely want you to, you know, talk to your medical professionals, but there is really like, there are, so there's a lot of people, a lot of people have talked to us that they've had benefits with just circulation, with blood pressure, with, um, a1c numbers everything so loading you know what message us yeah it's it's wonderful thing sorry janelle i just read someone on here yeah no good so Thank sorry you. they just said does it help with bloating yeah come in love often oh hey sweetie i'll be just a minute okay. um it does help with bloating i have to tell you i had a food baby for years and years and years and um it definitely helped with bloating i love it i had no idea how it felt to actually digest food and not have a food baby and until i started on plexus and honestly i don't have a food baby anymore i'm not yeah. bloated it's yeah. lovely so it's you guys lo i wonder if it's because these <laughs> I wonder if it's because these products give you the poops. I'm just curious if you guys that are watching, if you think <laughs> that's the case, drop a poop emoji in the comments. <laughs> we would love for you to try it. It really, that's why we talk about it, right, Christine? Because it changed we all everything. Time. Yep. It changed so much for me with my health journey, especially the reset. I love the reset. Yes. The three day supported fast has been a game changer with, for me with my 50 year old metabolism. Oh, you know I know. I mean? Tell so, me about it. My gosh, so 50 is a whole new is, thing. We would love for you to, to, we would love to send you some information messages either <laughs> on this page, life with health and happiness or messages through Christine's Instagram. Um, we would, you guys, there's a 60 day money back guarantee. There's no risk with these yeah. products. You can try it. I promise you're going to be thrilled. Let's talk about some of these products because I think that that is important. So they're talking about metabolism specifically and they said, you know, that they're 50. Okay. Metabolism is something I'm also working on at 42. And what I have learned through working with professionals is that the years of fasting has caused a lot of damage to my metabolism and being super restrictive has caused some problems with my metabolism. And so I'm in the process of doing a bulk because what has been alleged to me is that the only way to heal your metabolism is to eat. And so that is the reason that I'm doing a bulk. So the fact that they are trying to say that this is helping with that metabolism when that's not what I have learned and the 
uh, the dietitians I know are going to hop into these comments, the pharmacists, all those medical professional people. I know you guys are going to go crazy in the comments, but I, I find that really interesting that they're talking about that. Like it's a selling point, but that's not really how the body works. Anyways, one of their first products, one of the newest things that it's, that has been alleged that has come out is their reset, which is a three day fast. So a lot of these health and wellness companies, in my opinion, are going to start doing some of these fasting things. And yeah, they've got a whey protein and it is a bag for $53 or you could be a VIP customer and get it for $39. That's probably like an auto ship type thing. Uh, let's see. A lot of gut health stuff. And yeah. So. Let's see, they have skincare, they have, it looks like a multivitamin, they have kids multivitamins. So this is a, in my opinion, a typical health and wellness company. And I feel like these two are specifically targeting women their age. And I'm going to save my commentary on them being celebrities talking about an MLM product towards the end, but let's keep going. But if you're not, you can get your money back. There's no, there's no qualms. There's no problems. Oh here. my gosh. Janelle Sammy says truly we'll be driving soon enough. No. <laughs> I'm not. No. Oh my I'm gosh. Yes, for sure. Like a, yeah, any age guys, there's even kid products and that's the whole reason we're here because Maddie was looking for something for her baby. So yep. there's everything from kids to 18, 19 year olds. I, all my kids take it. Savannah can't go a day without her slim and her vital. All my kids take it. I don't know how many kids they have. I know that they have a lot of children. So my question is, are there children customers as well? Or are they front loading and then pulling from that inventory for their children? By the way, please don't give your kids an MLM product. Don't do that. Oh, biome. Like it's a, it's critical at our house. Critical. At yeah. our house. Same so. with us too. There's something lovely on there for stress. And then just, um, it makes a big difference for truly. She even had a hard time with family gatherings because our family's so big, but you know what love? I'm so sorry, but I have to go. I'm confused by that statement. Was she alluding to there's something for like social anxiety? Cause again, it's a health claim. You can't say that the things that they're talking about bloating, you know, gut health, um, I think there was mention of a product for energy because she mentioned caffeine in it. Those are all things that you can get from many companies that are not multi-level marketing companies. So yeah, it's been lovely chatting. Yep. 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 So anyway, go. please message us on whatever us with more, you're seeing yes, us. For sure. Janelle, good to see you. It's been a while. Yep. <laughs> all right. See you later. Take care. Okay, let's now really talk about this. So what we have seen in the last few years is the influencers on the social media platforms have become a prime target, in my opinion, for a lot of these people that are in multi-level marketing companies. And I think that the reason that they're doing that is because obviously these people have an audience. These two that we were just watching, they have an audience. They're on a TV show, oh, an interesting TV show. I'll leave it at that. Um, however, I think that there's a sense of responsibility that is lacking. I really do feel like these two are pitching and trying to shill this multi-level marketing um, company's product. And I think that that is extremely problematic. I think the way that they're going about doing it is not any different than what we see from multi-level marketers, but they have an audience. So it's, it's giving bait and switch that we saw specifically on TikTok and with prove it in the last couple years, there have been a lot of people on TikTok, influencers on TikTok that have had 
um, large audiences because of certain content that they put out. And then all of a sudden it's like, oh, now I'm going to talk to you about ketones. And I feel like that is the same thing. I also think that we see these uh, other celebrities that teach and speak at these companies' events. And I want to know what you guys think when it comes to this. Do you think that these celebrities that speak at these multi-level marketing companies' events, do you think they know what they're getting into? Do you think they know and have, have looked into the income disclosure statement and stuff like that? Or do you think that it's just a paid gig for them? Part of me wants to believe it's just a paid gig for them and they're showing up and they're doing their thing. But then you have Pitbull that was at the Herbalife convention talking about how he's used it. I think he said since 2004 or something like that and how, oh, it's creating all these opportunities. But if you looked at what this was doing, but what Herbalife was doing specifically to the Hispanic community, you would see that they are preying on them. And here you have people, somebody that is an icon within their community that's basically endorsing what they're doing. And they're all at this indoctrination event and it's just pushing people deeper and deeper into it. So if Pitbull actually looked at what this was as the entrepreneur that he really is, I wonder if he would have that same kind of energy. I wonder if he would have accepted that gig. I wonder if he would have you know, said what he has said about it. You know, I, it's just very interesting to me. And I think there's, there's a sense of responsibility that is lacking when it comes to on many things, but specifically we're talking about celebrities in multi-level marketing companies. And I think that these two, I think that, you know, they could be using their platform for so many better things. They could start a business of their own, but the fact that they're partnered with a multi-level marketing company where the majority of people, according to the FTC, 99.7% of people lose money or don't make any at all. And then they are lackluster products. A lot of the time overpriced products to accommodate for paying those bonuses on recruiting. You know, I hope that they start to question. I don't know how long they have been in, in Plexus. I don't know how long they've been doing it. I don't know how deep they are. I don't know if they're working it together. If you guys have any information on that, let me know. This is just kind of like a first look, if you will. Um, but I think the fact that you have these celebrities or these influencers that have these large following, this is exactly the problem that we talk about in, in anti-MLM with multi-level marketing companies. The people that are very successful are the ones that have a large following and or they get in earlier. So these two have a following because they're on a TV show. And I think the fact that they're using that to pitch a product that in a company that uh, that hurt, in my opinion, a lot of people and people lose money, according to the FTC and their own income disclosure statement. I just think that it's really disgusting. So am I going to do more videos on this? Yes, absolutely. If you guys have any videos or anything like that that you want to send my way, feel free to upload it to a Google Drive and then you can share it with my email. And my email is Aaron underscore bees at yahoo.com. I think that, I don't know, I just, I, I really want to start talking about this a little bit more. Influencers, not just top leaders in these multi level marketing companies, but the ones that are specifically uh, influencers, the ones that are celebrities. Maybe it'll be a series. I don't know. This is the first one, but I think it's disgusting. I really do. I think that these two seem to be good humans from what I've seen. Uh, and the fact that they're trying to shill this MLM product is, is extremely problematic. So anyways, thank you guys for being here. If you loved this video and this conversation that we have had today, feel free to give me a thumbs up. If you have not already subscribed, I would love for you to subscribe. I appreciate you guys so much and, uh, don't join an MLM. Okay. Don't do that. All right. I will see you guys on the next video. Have a good one, everybody. See ya.